I'm Henry the Eighth, I am, Henry the Eighth, I am, I am. I got married to the widow next door, she's been married seven times before, and everyone was an Henry, Henry, couldn't be a Willie or a Sam. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> Welcome back to our stupid rag since you did some Corbin. What? I just wanted to make you look. I'm Rick. Haha! I mean, follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy Instagram, content. Twitter, Twitter for more juicy content. Follow, content. Content. follow us on Facebook. Bang! Bang! So juicy. Today. Today! Today. Um, happy Diwali. Happy Diwali. Uh, today we are reacting to uh, the best. Hold on. Let me make sure. The best part of waking up is folders in your cup? Yes. Um, best Diwali, uh, emotional Diwali ads. Oh, nice. Yes, yes. obviously we know about the festival of Diwali. Holiday ads. Do that kind of stuff. Uh, and I'm sure, because at Christmas time, huge. That's when you get, like, emotional, that'll make moms cry. Especially Budweiser. They do it at the Super Bowl, too. Yeah. Yeah. They'll make, uh, like, anything with a kid. Family reunion, yeah. somebody yeah. coming home from the military. <clears throat> that's um, a big thing, so I'm guessing it's probably similar with Diwali, it being such a big festival sure um but yeah so this was uh best emotional dwelling ads here we go nikle jo tum aaj ghar se farmayishon ki fehrist saath leke batuwe mein band karke wo note hazaar tum nikle bhari dopehri khareedne bazaar इस चका चूंद इस धक्का मुक्की में शायद तुम लेना भूल गए ये कच्ची मिट्टी के पक्के दिए तुम साथ ले जाना भूल गए भूल गए बचपन में कैसे इनसे घर रोशन करते थे तुम जिद करके बार बार दो दिए ज्यादा लिया करते थे अरे जब तक ये सब बिक ना जाए काहे की है पी दिवाली अरे तू रह दे रहा अब तू मेरी छोड़ खुश है खुश है ये ले ये ले ये दो रखते थैंक यू अम्मा और आप फिक्र मत कीजिए सारे दिए बिक जाएंगे बाय इसी आस की मिट्टी लेकर मैं आशा के दिए बनाती हूँ और हर दिवाली जरा जरा मैं इसी बाजार बिखर जाती हूँ हर से बाद वो आज फिर यहाँ आया है उसने इन दिनों को गले लगाया बुझ गई थी उम्मीद की जो आखिरी मशाल इस दिवाली किसी ने उस अंधेरे में एक हल्का सा दिया जलाया stories of people rallying to people just like that that's great are yaar mainu dikhai nahi de raha kya so raha hu niklo us 
का नाटक रोहन अभी किया था उसने हाँ तो क्या हो गया फिर से कर देगी छोटा था ही तो काम है गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग जल्दी से तैयार हो जाओ बहुत काम है क्या काम है दिवाली की सफाइयाँ कौन करेगा मीनू आएगी तो अभी कर देगी बेटा दिवाली में सबकी छुट्टी होती है नहीं माँ मैं नहीं कर रहा ये मेरा काम नहीं है फिर दिवाली पर कोई पैसे नहीं मिलेंगे ये क्या बात होती है यार अब भी देखो वहाँ कितना गंदा है देखो बस हो गया इससे ज्यादा मेरे बस का नहीं है मीनू होती तो सही से करती हाँ तो अपनी मीनू से ही करवा लेना मीनू जरा पंखा साफ कर दो हाँ आई ये मीनू तो छुट्टी पे थी अगर मीनू की छुट्टी ना होती तो कैसे पता चलता कि वो कितना काम करती है रुको मीनू माँ ये मैं दे दू हाँ दे दो और सुनो ये भी देना साहब ठीक है Stop being an asshole. <laughs> There you go. One good deed does not. <laughs> Happy Diwali. Meenu Didi. Thank you, Bhaiya. Happy Diwali. That's a good one. Good deed is not done. You are a lifetime of wickedness, Rick. ये सब करने की क्या जरूरत है? ये सारे कपड़े मैले हो गए. It doesn't the color purple. ये मैल तो धुल जाएगा. पर तुम्हारे मन का मैल तो धुल गया ना? बस. You still an ass. काम कोई छोटा बड़ा नहीं हो. I'm so cynical. हर काम की है. I think he is an asshole still. सारे मैल धुला दो. घड़ी डिटर्जेंट की है. Anybody who treats people that serve other people like that. नहीं बीर है. दिवाली में पूरा इंडिया अपने घर जा रहा है पर बलबीर नहीं गुड्डू और पीहू को पटाखे तो मिल गए पर हाथ पकड़ने के लिए इस बार पापा नहीं होंगे शादी के बाद की पहली दिवाली स्निग्धा को दूसरे साल मनानी होगी और दिवाली की फैमिली फोटो में मिस्टर भट्टाचार्य इस बार भी मिस हो रहे हैं दिवाली में पूरा इंडिया घर जा रहा है पर ये नहीं क्योंकि ये ये हमें घर पहुंचा रहे हैं पर कभी कभी हम ये बात भूल जाते हैं ताकि हम दिवाली अपनों के साथ मना सके
Don't do it that this close currently. Yeah. Wear your mask, social distance. <laughs> Don't touch. Especially your grandma. <laughs> yeah, this is a really heartwarming ad. This is a good one. Yeah. Don't get you with that one, got me. <laughs> <laughs> Especially her alone. That's a great ad. It's a really good ad. Yeah, everybody be talking about this one here. You should always thank people in service. Yep. Always, 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 but always especially be, during the holidays. Always be kind to anybody in service. Yeah. Hey everyone, it's Deepawali season, and let's get in a festive food with some of Malaysia's top hits. Papa, how come ah? Got Chinese New Song, got Hari Raya Song, but got no Deepawali song ah? Anybody can answer his questions? <laughs> Shut up, son. That's a good question. <laughs> wow. Don't ask questions, son. Mom, if fat is beautiful, does that mean that I'm not beautiful? Uh. What the? What the f How flying crap How was that? How come for rent, no Indians? That's something you should talk to Dad, you should, you should answer that question, Dad. Amma, earlier, Johnny's mother said that if he's not teal, the Apu Nini will come and catch him. But if I'm not teal, who will come and catch me? Kumar, can you stop asking so many questions, sir? Go get changed and help your car, please. Uh... You should always want your kids asking questions, and then you should answer them no matter how difficult the question is. Thanks, bye. Sister will be straight with him. Okay. Am I bad for asking so many questions? Never, Kumar. There you go. <coughs> you see, parents are dumb. Questions are like lights. They can. Show us what's hidden and guide us to the truth. But sometimes people are scared of them because they can burn. Good analogy. And Deepawali is all about discovering this light. Mm. Well done, sis. The knowledge which extinguishes ignorance and opens up our minds to change the world. So Never lose the light in you. <laughs> thank you, Kia and Sumia. They were all great. Yeah, thank the stupid family. I believe yeah, came up with this compilation. You. So thank you guys. Those beautiful. Were all really great. I love the message behind a lot of the last one. Make sure you're asking questions. Yes. Answer parents. Answer your kids' questions. Every <laughs> single one. <laughs> like that's what I. I We'll just touch on that one. That's one of the things I've never understood. It's like, what? wouldn't you want to be the one that answers your kids' questions? Because they're going to have them, and they're going to get that answer They're going to find the answer somewhere. Wouldn't you want you to be the one that answers Absolutely. that question? Absolutely. Of course. Like, <laughs> like, I don't get it. I don't get it either. Um, but, yeah, it's just me. Uh, yeah, there's, there's, I'm, I'm with you, man. There's literally nothing my kids could have asked me at any point where I would have not wanted them to ask that. And there were times they asked questions that they weren't ready for the answer yet. Mm -hmm. And I told them that, and they just trusted it. The same way they trusted, Dad, can I see that movie? No, sweetheart, I've seen it. It's, it's R, it's way too intense for you right now, but when you're old enough, we will. Mm -hmm. And they accepted it because I had spent the entirety of their life answering their questions. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, I definitely like the the service industry one. Oh yeah, uh, they were all great, uh, and these are some really great ads that would be really good ads here as well. Yeah, um, they, would. they should learn about that the stuff here. And, yeah, because it's the same spirit here for Thanksgiving and Christmas. Yeah, it's, 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 these are those exactly the same spirit of taking care of each other, stopping for a minute and taking a breath and recognizing your blessings. Yeah, that's and, yeah. You, I have. I was a waiter for five years. I've I've done many other service industry things and have missed holidays with my family and been having to work during the big game. You know, so when you're like, if you're going to a restaurant to watch the big game or it's the big, or you're taking the Uber for your celebrations on that holiday, it's really easy to take for granted that those, those people aren't. Yeah. And I like how that, that commercial did it. it, it yeah. You thought it was about these people that were going home, but no, it's about the people taking you, taking them there. That was uh, really great twist. Can't, they can't afford to take off exactly. a holiday. Literally literally can't afford and that beautiful thing with you know his mom is alone mm. you know he wants to be with her but he can't miss work yep gotta pay the bills gotta pay the bills and he's probably taking care of her he's probably sending her the money he's making mm -hmm. and people were nice to him and so he called her up and always they were able to connect it's beautiful. There was, uh, that's what I like about these. This is all about being nice because uh, I know uh, maids are a huge part of Indian culture. Huge, massive. Which I, is, housekeepers it, is a massive thing. It's not here. Not, if you have, it's one of the things I talked to Andrani yeah. about. That uh, if you say my maid or my housekeeper, you're you're typically rich. wealthy. Yeah. yeah. People assume if you have a maid, you're wealthy. You're rich. Mm -hmm. uh, that's because I'm guessing they're just a lot more expensive here. Oh, there's no, it's uh, not no even comparison. Yeah. No comparison. Um, but Whereas they're common in India. So, and I'm, I'm assuming a lot of them do get treated the way that kid treated them. They do. They get treated that way because many of them come from a lower caste. Yeah. Many of them come from the countryside and they come into the city to work and then they leave. Um, and thankfully, if anybody treats <laughs> a maid or a person in the service industry, they need to be slapped across the face. Yeah. You're a terrible person yeah. and you should die. It's a, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, that, that, those, all of them were beautiful. Yeah. Those were, were all great. The first one about, you know, helping the, the day workers, uh, that are trying to sell yeah. stuff. It, it, that's even more poignant now yep. with the, the pandemic and how those people were extremely and, hurt by the pandemic. And now you're going to add to it the fact that the pandemic is still exploding and it's going to get cold. <clears throat> Yep, and it's probably going to get worse. And it's going to get harder for them because there aren't going to be as many people out on the street because of the weather. They're going to have a harder time surviving out on the street. So if there's ever a time we really need to pay attention to taking care of each other, yeah. This is so great those reminders. are great. Great reminder. Uh, please, happy Diwali to everyone. Yeah, please happy Diwali, everybody. Use it as an opportunity to show love to someone who can't go home for Diwali or just, just show love to everyone always. And, and follow that instinct. You felt it. Follow that instinct when you walk by somebody and that little voice in your head says, give them, give them a couple of rupees mm. or tell somebody like you you see somebody, you notice, wow, that, that person, she's got a really bright smile and you hesitate to say it cause you think they may take it the wrong way and just tell them, say, you know what? I love your smile. You're such a happy person. You made my experience brighter. Those little things go a long way. Give so, a valet driver 20 rupees. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, I think you meant was 200. 200. It, was, it was 500 rupees. Oh, it was 500 rupees. You gave a 500 rupee tip. Okay. Give yeah. a, do that. Give everybody you know 500 rupee tips. Yeah. Just all day long. Hashtag 500 rupee tips for everyone on Diwali. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Look, <laughs> my